Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today, oops, we're headed out. First thing, Sophie's having a lesson first thing. I do not know how life is gonna work for Gabby, let me tell you, I, you can't hurry her. Like, Sam and I argued, like, so Sam went over to do chores this morning. I said, who's gonna wait for Gabby? And he said, you wait for Gabby. I said, no, you wait for Gabby. And he said, no, I have to do chores, you wait for Gabby. So I ended up having to wait for Gabby. So here we are, <laughs> waiting for Gabby. All right, so somebody's horse needs cleaning up. Yeah, it's your job. <laughs> no, your job. You're the parent. She's just kidding. A lot of people, when Sophie jokes. I'll end up cleaning it up later after he poops again. No, you're doing it now. So are you actually riding with that? Is that what you're doing? Well, I want to, I think it will be funny. <laughs> Gabby is funny. Things always get way messier before they get cleaner. Our, our, our barn, you guys, this barn, whoa, a mess. I got lots of water in the fridge though. I can't wait till we move the barn over. Oh, wait, you're putting this on storm? No, yes. I'm just trying it. All right, did um, the trainer message that she's on her way? Where's my phone? Oh, no, no. Well, Sophie's on. I thought we put the other one there. Move forward. You're putting a martingale on Chino? Well, I'm not riding with this part. I'll tie it up. Oh, all right. I but see. Like, well, you do what you want to do, sister. All in the name of making him more bomb proof. So you tie it up. <laughs> and then he's got a grass skirt on. Well, you put the other one on. Like that. Cute. Your saddle does not fit him anymore. Because he's got muscle. Oh. But he kind of lost that. Because someone decided to lose a shoe. Right, Storm? <laughs> he's like, oh, I will defy you at all costs. You decided to lose You the guys shoe. don't know what a troublemaker this boy is. <laughs> See, he just hit you. Not because he lost the shoe, but because he is, oh, he's just Stirs a brat. Like hard work. But he's our brat, and we love him. Oh, that's right. So I was wondering why the girls didn't go out today, and they didn't go out because you got to take off those bell boots. They didn't go out because Storm can't function if they're not near him, which is our fault. Obviously, we need to make him not herd bound, but it is hard when horses are with each other 24 seven. Wow. Our arena is looking a little rough. <laughs> it's soon gonna say goodbye to this little field, you guys. I'm so sad so much stuff blew over, but it's... Just leave it. Just leave them. All right, so I that's... That All right, I'm gonna do the water though. What water? The little water jump. Recently somewhere I saw where they stuck noodles in something like this. Sam made this for flowers. But it would be so cool to put noodles in there. I'm going to do that at our new farm. Yeah, don't so when I was setting this thing up, literally I knew we were going to have to rip it all down. But my idea was that better to have it all out here and easier to like rip down. It just sucks that... The trainer is gonna see the arena all messy. Oh, here comes, here she comes. So, I got a comment recently, a really nice comment meant in a really nice way, saying stuff like that I shouldn't encourage Sophie's chicken attitude. <laughs> and that I've treated Gabby and Sophie so differently, and that's why Sophie's a chicken. But she didn't actually say it that way and she was not being mean. She was being incredibly kind and it gave me a lot to think about and I appreciated it, but I've been thinking about it a lot because just like now, Sophie won't get on storm because she just has to make sure he's okay. And I've tried all different ways to encourage Sophie and to get her not to be the way she is, but she, I'm that way. And she, and it'll all click with her one day like it clicked with me. Like she's only 13, she has so much time. And I do treat them differently. I treat them differently because I'm the kind of parent that tries a million different things to see what works best for each kid. Every kid needs something different. Take off those boots. Me? No, Sophie will. <laughs> okay, okay, I can hop on now, she says. She just wanted to make sure that he wasn't gonna be an idiot. Whether or not it's my fault, because I'm like, I've changed how I respond to Sophie being nervous. 
I've done the same way I've done it with Gabby. But like this girl said, Sophie's had totally different experiences and that's true. And even though it sucks that maybe her experience hasn't been picture perfect the way it has been for Gabby, but it's also teaching her stuff. It's also her journey. Like I can't control every single thing that happens. And I don't know, I believe a lot in fate and faith and I believe a lot in how things unfold the way your life is meant to unfold and I am at the stage now where I want to support Sophie as a person and I want to support her if she's nervous I know she's gonna come out of it because I did and she's exactly like me and she's not so super nervous she just needs to feel comfortable like she just needs to feel comfortable and I'm the same way if I wasn't running Penny, I would be exactly like her still. Penny built confidence in me, and that time is gonna come for Sophie. <laughs> what? She know had energy walking towards the barn. She know had energy walking the towards storm. the barn. Storm had energy near the end of the lesson. I'll, I'm gonna post those, that lesson for you guys. I just like, I didn't film the whole thing. I haven't been filming the whole entire lesson. It's hard to film the whole entire lesson. So I just filmed like the best parts. I don't know, I think it's enough to make a video, but I, every time I split videos up, which I have to split videos up, like riding videos, every time I split them up, people think we are not doing the things that I don't show. So I don't know, it gets confusing, guys. I've been holding on, I wouldn't let you go. Cause every time I try you find a loophole I've been slamming the door and just leave you go When I come back you feed it up the side. Penny still asks me for a treat even when I have no treats I got no treats <laughs> Jake oh man I almost fell off multiple times Why? Because Storm he like stepped to the side because I was telling him and I went, Pew! like, I'm bad at turning corners, that's why bareback is good. So, I lost my balance and I had nothing to hold on to because someone doesn't have many mane. Much mane? Many mane or much? Any mane. She doesn't, he doesn't have, have any mane. Water. I was trying to pass by Gabby and Storm's like, I'm going to crash into her. She fell unsteady a bunch of times in the left and because she's riding bareback. When I got on, Storm moved over after I was like, almost sitting fully on him. Oh, is that he why you almost over. fell? So we set up this little area outside the house with food and water for our goose. We don't put the goose and the duck together yet because she's so much bigger than the, the duck. She doesn't like the dog, so she's hissing at them. Anyway, I'm going to bring her out and play with her in a little bit. I've been... My dog's going to the road. I've, oh, the great escaper. Daisy is a... Uh, Hey, no, come on, this way. Hey, Daisy, come on, she come on, too hot. come on. So she <laughs> likes to run to the road because she ran to the road one day and when she did, there were people on the road walking and they petted her and so now she tries to go to the road. I have to get rid of this pallet that was in the barn. It's just heavy to carry. So I'm gonna get somebody to help me with that. I'm cleaning all the wood out of the barn. Yeah, it's Ray. nice dark. You want me to open Ray, the door? Let's see? lock them in. Let's lock the dogs in. Close that door, I said. Okay, so. Guys, her name is Lucy Lou. So this is Lucy now. She changed her name to Lucy. Because I couldn't remember her. What is all over your hands? Me? Yeah. Oh, that's dirt from Storm. I didn't have a chance to clean my hands yet. Tomorrow is the day. Like, tomorrow is the day that Sam's going to do... Bye. The majority of the work so he's gonna well actually his plans <laughs> we still have to fix this area here put like well he put metal here to support this but he needs to close off that section tomorrow is the day that he is actually gonna finish these stalls and then we're gonna bring the mats over so I don't even know if we're gonna start the mats tomorrow but he's gonna the wood is being delivered tomorrow so he's filling in all these spots and he says he's filling in there too. I don't know if he'll have enough wood for that. All the hay gone from here. I still have, oh, did I get it all from this stall? All from that stall gone, all from this stall gone. I still have to go in there and rake. I'm gonna do that right now. 
I've been going along, and so yesterday, before it rained, I was, ow, digging out all these staples. It's hard to do it when you have kids, though, that want to show you their babies. No, it's not my baby. What? Oh my gosh. It's what? your baby. What are you doing? <laughs> she thinks she's a goose. She's eating the grass, and she's in the pool. Didn't they poop in that? Yes. Don't drink it. Anyway. <laughs> Doesn't matter where we live, our dog likes water. It's cold water. Yeah, I like this bench. Okay, so clearly we have some sycamore trees. Not this one. Which are super annoying, but I don't think the horses are gonna eat them. This one I might get Sam to just cut down because it's just in an awkward place anyway. We still have a lot to do. What you guys haven't been seeing is us bringing stuff home and trying to unpack our house as well so de ow. definitely a couple of sycamore trees in the pasture at least one anyways we're going to take a walk around we've done a lot of walkthroughs trying to see like what's happening in each pasture i've seen some comments about the fencing over there that it's not in good repair but there is a couple and there is a couple of spots where it's kind of down and there's a tree down over there that i'm going to pick up before we bring our horses home uh, but the fence, let me show you. So this is where the fence is down over here. And Sophie and I took a walk along here the other day. So uh, we're definitely going to tie them back up. Woo! Tie it back up just so our horses don't get hurt on it. But the, but the field is still fenced in. Like It's not like the horses are going to get out. If they get out of this area, there's still that big fence there. So it's just an eyesore for the most part. None of our horses are super ambitious to try and jump a fence like this, but we are gonna put it back up just so it looks nicer. But we've literally walked all along the fence line. Nothing is gonna happen on this farm until tomorrow when Sam gets the wood and then he can, actually, he's gonna work on Chino's field today. But also this tree fell through the fence and it's not a big deal the fence isn't taken down except for that I don't want this in our field for our horses to get hurt and when we were out riding I swear I saw a fence back here somewhere like another fence a gate but I can't find it anyway lots of grass back here nice grass not a lot of weeds come on it's still a lot of work to do, but we, like I said, Sam's, we've been doing little tiny bits and trying to move in. I can't, once the wood gets here tomorrow, it'll all pick up. We had the farrier yesterday. We had riding lessons this morning. We're still trying to move stuff. I love being in this barn you guys like this barn just makes me happy I love how open it is I love the wood I love how rustic it is I love it I love old barns or I love like rustic barns so I think we should bring the futon and put it right there I don't know what futon is it sounds like food <laughs> it's not food, it food. <laughs> oh that's really cute um this one would have been a good photo if Molly Hadn't scared her? Yes. Okay, so it's the couch in the arena. I think we should put it right there on that wall. We don't have an arena. At the old place. Oh. I think it's a really good idea because then we could sit in here like. I think we should get like five more of these. I know, this duck is so cute. The goose is friendly too now. Yeah, the goose runs to us now. Yeah. But we're she scares quarantining you her. Go to the bathroom. We're, oh, we had her in the bathroom. She, we're quarantining her. Oh my gosh, her. she scared me so badly. We're, I screamed and ran. We're, because nobody knew we were keeping her in the bathroom. When we left to go today, I put her in the bathroom just because um, it was easier. We're quarantining them, keeping them away from like our other animals and stuff, our other chickens. 
just to make sure that they're okay. You never know what you're gonna get at a sales barn. I don't know if I showed you guys this, the new locks. I don't know what that's for. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. Uh-oh. <laughs> you're locked in. Um, it still doesn't close. Yeah, that one you have to push. I really wanna take this thing off today. I haven't actually even been in this section. Like who fits through that? <laughs> oh, I do. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna clean this little stall up today. I've been uh, cleaning above, I've been cleaning the wood there, but it's really hard for me to reach the top, so I'm gonna have to get a ladder to okay. do that. This is where we're going to put cross ties and stuff. I just don't know how it's gonna work out. But actually, we might like make them tied up to this area and put their bums out that way. So tie up to here Try and to then- lock your parent in the stall. Lure them in the stall. I can unlock myself in this stall. Oh. <laughs> She's like, I know what it's like to be a horse. <laughs> anyway, Sam's gonna take this stuff out. So this can be a bigger stall. It should be Chino stall. This should be Chino stall, but I don't, Chino is, Chino likes the stall. He actually does. How many does. stalls do we need? We don't even, we need one for Storm because Storm's, Storm's the one I don't trust to leave alone at night outside. Okay, so. Make this storm stall. This should be and storm. And then take that middle part out of that one and make that Chino's. Yeah. Cause Chino's a big horse. Chino is a big horse. Oh,